keep your renters there because I could have got all my money back. Mm. They didn't even touch those that's, houses. That's the crazy part. I met so many Nobody people told who, me that, man. Who, who, who lost in the real estate bubble. Mm-hmm. And I said, and when I w- went down and started asking questions, I'm like, where, where is it still renting? Mm. Or at least a, the cost of the mortgage? And they were like, yeah. And I'm like, so why would you get rid of it? I had great renters. I was told by the bankruptcy attorney, he's like, look, you can keep one house, one car. And I was so fucked up over everything that was happening. Right. I'm like, I just was like, you know what? I told everybody, I'm like, yo, you guys got to be out in 30 days. Pack my shit, move to L.A., come back three years later, and all the houses well, are still sitting You know untouched. why the bankruptcy attorney told you that, right? No. Because he make his fees off of you filing bankruptcy. Like Thank you. He's not a real estate person. That's just like when I talk to accountants. I, I, I tell well, I'm people like, how, was, how did accountants, nobody in that day— estate? How come nobody on that day knew that? Lack like of, to say like, yo, lack of knowledge. keep rent, like keep it going. Because you got to remember most people who were buying up all these uh, homes really wasn't doing it for real estate Yeah, because it was easy. Mm. If you could fog people. a mirror, they gave you a house back then. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> you know yeah. what well, I'm saying? Well, that's what they said. They said countrywide with me, like, you know, Literally. they were saying credit wise, you wouldn't even have got a house. But the fact you had 25 grand, then you're they approved. They didn't care. If you, fo- if you fogged a mirror, yeah. you got a property back then.